Paper Mario and the Origami King. There it is. I love the graphics in this game. Don't you? Man, the Switch is so powerful. Sometimes I feel like it's got better resolution than the original Game Boy. And I'm like, nah. Let's fix that, shall we? So welcome to the stream. If you missed it, I streamed Animal Crossing earlier. And now I have a little bit of a headache. And I'm here. Here. And uh, Vinny, did you cook? I did. I made the steak. And the asparagus. So this is Paper Mario. Did you enjoy your asparagus? I was very happy to have Smelly P. And, uh... I was gonna maybe do Castlevania as well as Paper Mario. Pape. But I decided, um... Just to do this. Because I might end the stream a little early. And get some rest. Not too early. But we'll, we'll have a good Paper Mario stream. Instead of, you know, trying to rush to get a Castlevania stream in as well. Where I can do a, um... A better more effective Castlevania stream, like tomorrow. Vinny, I find myself vigorously yelling in Mario's voice, how do I stop this? Y you just, you know, you just close your mouth. Let me see if I can do a Mario voice with my mouth closed. That's just Toad. So there's a new shop that opened up in town. Um, I'm back from vacation, by the way. I saw that mountain. Anybody who's watching this in the future all together, and you don't, you know, you didn't have to wait five days. I saw the mountain. Talked about it earlier. Didn't climb it, but saw it. It was... It was pleasurable. Pleasant. I guess that works too, yeah. That's a good word. Pleasant. Mario! See, now I'm doing it. What the hell? What, what's, uh, where did I open up? Someone said there's a, a heart inside the brick building. And then I opened up a shop. Vinny, is your fan on? Yeah, it's too hot not to have a fan on right now. But it's air conditioner. So, you know, it's it's just really hot out. And it, it started raining a little while ago. Is this potentially where, where a heart might be? No, I already got all this stuff. Press X, let Olivia furnish you. Right, so w that's where I was. I came back here because I unlocked a new toad house. Tis I, the love toad, at your service, my lud. I'm able to feel all of the love lost in this world. Now then! At this precise moment, there is no love lost. Ah, but let not your guard slip. We are but the... in the eye of love tempest. So, I guess if you miss... a power-up, that toad will be like... Listen, you missed it. Go back, get it. What about a Wario voice? Mm. With mouth closed? That could- yeah, that one works. Vin someone said Vinny is back. I, I- I was back yesterday as well. I'm back today, too. Alright, chat, one more time, because the chat was going too fast, I couldn't tell. Am I- uh, should I go to the store that I missed? Is there a store that I missed, or no? I think it was just Love Toad. So what happened was, I saw someone in chat say, Vinny, you unlocked a new store. And that... wasted... 10 minutes of stream time. That we'll never get back. Oh, this is the wrong way. <laughs> Excuse me, my allergies have been acting up. If, if I sound a little congested, it's because uh, I am- I was last night, too. I went to, um, this park I like today, and did maybe an hour, hour and a half of hanging out, walking, get some walking time in. And there was, uh, one of those large lawnmowers that you can drive around. That's probably really fun. And the lawnmower was just, like, cutting all this allergen into my nose directly. So... I don't know if it was that, but I noticed it a little bit earlier, too, and then I was fine for Animal Crossing, and now I notice it again, and I have a little bit of a headache. I'm assuming it's allergies. Not like anyone here ne really needs to know any of this information. It's... it's... irrelevant to your stream experience. God damn it! Oh, okay, I thought I had to go back to Toad Town. Well, yeah, I need this. This is very important. You know what else is important? 
What, Mario? Nothing. No, Mario, I, I'm thinking you had something important to tell me. Nope. Nothing, Luigi. Don't worry about it. I got a chance to play a little bit of Xenoblade. I'm up to Prison Island. Like, just before it. So, you know, that's why... There will be, um, another chatless stream of Xenoblade. Hmm. I just didn't see it. Like, my brain had... It couldn't see the solution. No, Mario, really tell me! You know, what is it? Is it something I gotta do? I gotta know? Mario, I... I didn't get a lot of guidance growing up from Papa Mario, you know, so... You, you gotta, you gotta take control here and, and, and tell me what I'm missing! I wonder if, um, Mario and Luigi's dad... ...was like some kind of legendary bambino. Some kind of legendary plumber. I wanna see that. I wanna see the, the Mario game that takes place in the 40s. Like, uh, Papa Mario in, in, like, World War II. Fixing the pipe so that the Allies can win. Like, he defected from... Italy? <laughs> I don't know! I heard the Shuriken Dojo behind here has some great prizes, just wish someone else was running it. Someone said in chat, defected from the Italians to the Japanese. Actually... Actually... Yeah, kinda. Well, my favorite Zabutton was stolen again. What's Zabutton? We've been playing musical chairs with our Zabuttons. Zabutons? That's a kind of cushion used to sit on tatomi mats. Oh. Thanks, Toad. Whew, I snagged a Zabuton just in time. It's not tatomi? What is it? What did I say? Uh, did I say it wrong? Tatami. Tatomi wise. <laughs> Picture Cuphead, but Mario's dead. And now you see the potential of this... of this idea. Not really? Mm. Alright. Never mind. What is the donkey here thing from? It's... Will Sasso did an impression of Arnold Schwarzenegger. And dubbed over... a video of him talking. I mean, Arnold Schwarzenegger was talking about how he has a donkey. Funny Lemon Man? That's true, yeah. I was just taking a little cat nap, don't mind me. Ah! Kinda wish I was a cat again, they've got it pretty easy. Cats exist to... Um, consume our resources, us humans. Without quality armor, you're, you're gonna get some weapons! Your memory of that quote keeps getting worse, good job. I'm watching over this area for, for hours. Nothing slips past me, even though my eyesight is awful. Meow out quality me armor. Meow weapons. Meow dude. I don't know. I really don't remember. Yeah, you're right. I don't remember what that that cat said. So, Impractical Jokers is a funny show because uh, I don't watch TV really. I don't have cable. I just I've seen you know stuff from the Impractical Jokers. And, uh, obviously, one of them I know a little tiny bit. Because they are from Staten Island. And Sal Volcano is a dude that I've- I've met. Worked with him. Briefly. Ten years ago. Um, so I'm pretty much famous because I- I- I've worked with him. Twice. No, when I say worked with him, he was on a public access television show. And he- he, um... I think he- either hung out or co-owned or something, a local bar. So I've seen him. He, he's um, in a group of friends that I know. I wasn't close with him, but we've had several conversations. So I'm a famous man, as you can tell, because I know the guy who fails all the challenges. But that show, now I know how Bug feels. Take it from me, it's gross. That show is, is both funny and extremely predictable. Grasshoppers can jump super high. You'd love it, Mario. Hmm, I didn't even get to flutter on the breeze. There's an example that I had, I can't, I can't think of it now. <laughs> Look at this toad. I am one with the bonsai, I've achieved total serenity. My feet are asleep. Alright, now make a buzzing noise. Alright, now, now say... Now, alright, now say that you took a poop on the street. <sighs> I got... Ah, oh, 
he can't do it! He can't do it! It really is such a simple formula. But I, I really have to wonder, like, at this point, are there people that don't know who these, these guys are? I can hear something weird mumbling next door, it's really creepy. I guess there probably still are, but on some level, the later seasons, you can almost feel the people just playing along. Wish we had something better than this bone to toss back and forth. Have a hook. What, what's that thing? I was talking about Impractical Jokers chat for whoever was asking. It's just a television show where, again, I don't watch it, but watching a little bit of it while I was, you know, about to, like, go to bed, I'm like, wait a minute, I've seen this episode. I, I hadn't. I hadn't seen it. Oh, okay. All right, now make a noise like a refrigerator. Guys, won't that weird folded shy guy leave? Does it not know how to use a sliding door? <laughs> kind of just feel bad now. Poor, poor bastard. The ninja attraction is the most popular place in the whole park. I get lost every time. It's great. Did you see Jonathan Frakes' message to <laughs> Red Letter Media? No, I didn't. Let me guess, he's taking Bill Shatner's side. Even though there is no feud happening, and it's all just this bizarre invention. It's a cameo that someone ordered. He was paid to say it. Oh, okay, good. I'm, I'm glad that Frakesy isn't getting involved in any stupidity. He removed it when he discovered what it was for. Ugh. I don't get it. It's like... It's a couple little jokes here and there, but... It doesn't... Yeah, I don't know. Something about that's just weird. Well, it doesn't make sense. But it sucks because Red Letter Media, a lot of their humor... When it comes to Star Trek, like, it, it's dumb, but it's not, like, mean-spirited. A lot of it is just, like, silly. It's because Shatner watched the Nerd Crew video and thought it was real. Yeah, we discussed this last week. <laughs> Princess Handler notes. We're running low on her favorite chewing bones. Do not get near her without one. Also, Mike Stoklaza hates old people, and Shatner isn't old people. That's true. That's true. Trust me when I say Shatner would choose not to be an old people, if he could help it. If there is anyone fighting the Reaper more than Shatner, I'd sure like to know about that. The ninja house may sound like a harmless fun, but I'll bet there are baddies waiting to battle inside. You know, you can press plus to equip new boots and hammer, right? When you need to new boot goof. Bark, bark, bark. Oh, it's you, Mario. <laughs> Good timing, I spotted something that gave me pause. This guy is a fetching... Guy in a fetching green outfit... ...roughed... I mean, rushed into the ninja house over there. He was really woofing, I mean hoofing it. Must be something good in there. Green outfit. Ah, our mysterious man in green. Sounds like we're hot on his trail. So scary. How can something so round and cute be so frightening? Petting do. Mm hmm I know what I said. Someone in chat just said, my streamer fucked up the word zoo. I keep wondering, why is Shogun Studios named Shogun Studios? Oh, I know, it's because we're Shogun-a have a fun time here, right? M maybe that's it? That joke was so bad that I got health back. Sorry, there's no, re uh, there's no refunds on the streamer. Especially if the streamer is broken. You think that guy would rather have a sippy cup, or what? Okay! Attention, royalty has arrived. It's a good thing I got the expensive card. All of the serving glasses here are short and flat. I don't know how anyone drinks from these things. That's why I always carry my emergency sipping straw. I'll let you borrow it, but you might want to wipe it off first. Wow, this tea is so bitter. Ah! Should've gotten a soda like I usually do. Ew. But you have to wonder, why would anyone just give someone a used straw? Especially in this modern... ...world we live in. In these trying times. Bank of America is here for you. Boing! 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 Oh, shit! Loyal to the Bank of America. 
uh, REM lyric. Vinny map. Map. I know what I'm doing. I'm, I'm gonna get the bone. I'm gonna give them the straw and get the bone. I don't know what they're gonna do with the straw. I feel like the bone is probably the better option. Maybe this doesn't make any sense. What am I doing? What is that thing? Yeah, they don't want that. I don't want that shit. The guy who runs the shuriken dojo is always missing. Maybe he's hiding out in the staff room again, probably napping on the job. How many Twinkies can you eat in one sitting? What is that? I've eaten one Twinkie at a time. In one day. One. I would prefer not to eat Twinkies. And if I had to, one would be fine. I bought into the Zombieland propaganda. And I ate Twinkies. That might have been the last time. And then they went out of business, they disappeared for a while, people were upset, and then... They came back and people were happy. I don't know who those people were, but... Deep fried Twinkies? America! Yeah, we're gonna... Deep fry them Twinkies, yeah! Soar like an eagle, fly through your stomach, come out as a piece of shit. Oh no, that is an imposing castle. It looks over the entire park. The toads that work here are being held captive inside, right? Okay, you two, let's rescue the staff, get rid of the streamer. Hey! And save the park so we can have some fun. The gate won't open. She could have just knocked. Hey, anybody in there? Sorry I slammed into your door. Please open the gate. I don't think those folded soldiers are gonna open up for us, ma'am. Okay, so I'm clearly bad at this. The gate is too big and heavy for my tiny folds. Mario Dono, may I request your assistance? Hey, good effort. I'll lend a hand myself, but, well, you know, or I would... But, huh? Look, there's a keyhole here. How did I miss that? If there's a keyhole, then we just have to find the key. Easy peasy. Oh, that key could be hiding anywhere, ma'am. Oh, that's a little less easy. Park is huge. I guess we'd better start searching. Hey, couldn't help but overhear your little chat about that key. Let me save you some time. Staff members have to lock up each area of the park before clocking out for the night. If you can find the staff room here, I'll bet you find that gate key. Don't ask how I know. It's not like I hide here overnight to gorge myself on dumplings or anything. Do your toad voice. No, I'm good. I, I don't think... It's not good for my throat, but also there, there are people who do not want to hear it. Someone real suspicious was heading in the old ninja house! Trust me when I say that I know for a fact people do not want to hear this voice throughout the whole game. You could say I've been informed. And, uh, I'm one of them. It's like I'm drawing... ...magic from a draw point. Final Fantasy VIII prepared me well from this, uh, for this game. Wait, is Bomb really, uh, sorry, Bombi? Really asleep? Bombi! Please! Whoa! They're so impressed. Go, Bobby. Good job, Bobby. Also, think about how many pieces of furniture you could make if you had this many cherry blossom petals in Animal Crossing. So much furniture. Do your thousand-fold arms feel off-center? If they do, just press R to reset the, their orientation. Wondering how I knew about that? Hey, don't worry about it. I thought we were training with Shriekrin today, but... It's actually Reed Pipe Day. Oh, my shame. I don't want to fall behind. There has to be something I can use to breathe underwater. Whoa! It's... it's perfect! It's like this tube was made for the ninja arts. I propose a trade. You're a breathing tube for my Shuriken. How about it? Yes, thank you, thank you, my shuriken are all yours!
Lord, this weed pipe tastes like cheese with a smack of silver. That big building across the river is the house of tricky ninjas. I swore never to go back there, but my teacher must be avenged. They lost their glasses in there once. Apparently, there's an update coming to, um... Call on duty. It's, it's a loot train that goes around the map. And, uh, you, you get to... It's got valuable stuff. It's, like, very valuable. When I think loot train these days, though, I can't help but think... Uh, the Game of Thrones loot train. And I'm like, oh, that's, oh. Or when I think loot train, I also think of, like, paid loot services. So I don't really like the word loot train, but I do like the game. And that sounds fun. It sounds like it's gonna be just, like, 50 to 60 people landing there every single match. Or trying to land on the train. Could be fun. They said they're de decreasing the size of the game in the next update. What does that mean? Decreasing the size of the game. The map? Or less people? They optimized it? Less gigabytes. Less junk data? Compressing the file sizes. Oh, no shit. So wait, do we know how, how optimized it's gonna be? People are joking and say it goes from 250 gigabytes down to, um, 249. No, apparently, uh, I don't know how true this is, because I'm getting Vinny, it was Japes, Vinny, it was not Japes, a million numbers, but... Someone said in chat, it's going from 200... to 150. <laughs> I'm saved! <clears throat> but my mouth tastes like ash. I'm in dire need of refreshment, maybe some tea will get the taste of soot out of my mouth. I saw this weird guy inside the tranquil pipes. Tr uh, tea house who, who drinks tea with a straw. <laughs> Someone mentioned Risk of Rain 2. I'm gonna wait for the 1.0 update. It's a week from today. That'll give me a chance to finish Carry In and a couple other games. Barn Finders. A bunch of staff members have been passing through here. The staff room must be nearby. Oh, yeah. Someone said that took me embarrassingly long to find. C I'll be honest with you. Under any other normal circumstances in any other video game, that would have taken me four years. I was fucking shocked at myself that I just found that. Halt, who goes there? Oh, it's you, Mario. Sorry, I thought you were in another intruder. I saw a suspicious character duck in here while I was folded up. He was wearing green clothes and a green hat. That's an extremely suspicious color, you know? I believe this is where Otacon hid. Now, I recognize... I recognize this. That's a Goomba. Welcome to the staff room of Shogun Studios, I guess. This is where we store equipment between productions. These masks are just gathering dust, dust back here. Feel free to try them on. Take them with you. Do whatever you want. I don't get paid enough to stop you. Jungle King mask. Why don't you try it on, Mario? Wait, I want the Samus mask. That's Big Kong energy. Wow, what animal is that? that something sound... Sounds like donk donk. Looks strong. Is it banging a gong? You know, like Klong? Nah, I must be mistaken. This is a good one. Convincing. Get it on. Bang a gong. Get it on. <laughs> Wow, she really, really needs to get out more. 
Oh, come on, this is hilarious. Mario wearing the head of a super scary paper macho soldier. He looks so wobbly and silly. It's just so goofy. Wow, well, Big M, you're a comedic genius. I guess this will come in handy if we ever need to send her into a full-on giggle fit. Boo! Boo! Ah, oh, that was so funny. I laughed so much that my creases started to crinkle. Ha ha ha. Space warrior mask. An otherworldly mask. Sadly, it won't allow you to roll into a ball. I'm very happy that a Metroid reference was... ...snuck in the game. Hmm. There's something you don't see every day. Yeah, it really is. Uh, you know, it would be... It would be nice if we could, um see more of this. Maybe not every day, but close enough. Certainly looks intimidating. Is he battling something? Looks like he's firing beams from his hand. That's pretty cool, but not exactly Big M's style. It'd probably look perfect on some other kind of M, though. Fuck. Fuck off. Fuck you. You- you do not reference Other M on this stream. You do, you do not. I did not. Mario, thank goodness you're here. Shogun Studios has been invaded by origami. It's so, so thematically appropriate. I mean, horrible! The staff room has everything you'll need to infiltrate the main castle, especially the... <gasps> the key! It's gone! Gone. The key. It's gone. The key is gone. Stop screaming! Everything. We're right here. Oh, sorry, little fellow. That key is just super, super important. It's a master key that can open every door in Shogun Studios. Every door. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That key is like the ruler over all the other park keys. We need that key. If it's missing, we have no choice but to track it down ourselves. Oh no! No, is that the heart? Heart! Okay! Ah, oh, that... That's a miss. Ah, uh, better luck next time. Huh? Ma Mario, hello! I run the Shuriken Dojo. It's our most popular attraction. I'm usually super busy, but... We had zero visitors today, so I was just, uh... Resting my eyes in here. Yep. Guess I'd better hurry back to the Shuriken Dojo. Stop by and check it out. No lines today. God, doesn't that sound great? Just to be clear, I wasn't sleeping. In fact, I worked through my lunch break. I'm still on the clock. Wouldn't that just be lovely? No lines. Where's that person who works at Six Flags? That was like, Vinny, I can get you in Six Flags. It's open. Can you close the park for a day and then get me in? The Marshmallow Fluff guy was- was Japes, but he did send me on, um, a link on Amazon to a 17-pound bag of fluff for, like, 40 bucks or something. Note, I do not actually need someone to close the Six Flags Park for me. This was a joke. I'm sure you're all aware of this. I don't know. I mean, it could be a joke. It, it could be correct. I don't know. I mean, this guy is very convincing. Ah. Uh, I don't know. Ugh, big turd. I can't seem to get enough rest. So sleepy. I cannot let anyone see my face of all the days to wake up with a zit. I can't use this stupid expensive royalty pass if I can't get out. I'm supposed to be having fun. I can't thank you enough for finding me, even if I can't get out of here. Toads get zits? Vinny, do you think toads get depressed? I think they do, yeah. Look at this one! How, how is this toad not depressed? Hey Mario, I came back to the- uh, to open the shuriken dojo, but... Someone swiped my shuriken. Uh, what am I supposed to do now? Just hope I run into some maniac carrying a spare sh set of shuriken? Yes. Whoa, well, Mario, you have shuriken on you? That's questionable, but very convenient for me. <laughs> I know what you're f gonna ask. Can this guy finally open the shuriken dojo now? <laughs> I sure can. 
Shoot, I messed that up. Sure can. Ah! Can we back up? What is this place? This shuriken dojo lets you folks test their skill. Let's folks... Uh, fo let's... Folks test their skill by hurling shuriken at a set of targets. Toads also sometimes screw up when they speak. If you can clear normal mode, you'll win a baseball signed by a genuine sports superstar. That sounds like fun. Can we try it, Mario? Am I supposed to shoot that toad? The toad's gotta be like bonus points. You can't? Oh. They're retrieving your missed shots. Oh, I wasn't paying enough attention to really notice that. What a surprise. <laughs> 